Another permanent ER closure in Ontario, Fort Erie and Port Colborne are having their urgent care centers closing permanently overnight. This means that between the hours of 10 p.m. and 10 a.m., there will be no urgent care centers in those areas, which I don't know if you've ever had to go to the ER, but that's typically when they're the most busy. And this comes due to the nursing shortage, which, by the way, is an artificial shortage created by the Ford government by not paying nurses enough and not providing enough training opportunities for them. For example, we're paying for cops to get trained. Why not pay for nurses? And around 10,000 people in Port Colborne do not have a family physician. This means that those people are at higher risk to having to use an urgent care center. And now those families will have to travel to other facilities in the Niagara region, which often already operate at above 100% capacity. And South Niagara families that just so happen to be represented by the NDP are being disproportionately affected. Because of the Conservatives' health care staffing crisis, that is another community that is not getting access to 24-7 care. And this is just another step towards the privatization of our healthcare system. As Doug Ford continues to starve the beast, he will come in eventually and say the only way to fix this problem is through privatization. But we know how to fix this problem, Doug. Fund healthcare appropriately. Pay nurses what they deserve. And pay to have them get trained. You know, all the things that we're doing for cops, do that for nurses. Follow if you want to stay updated on healthcare closures in Ontario.